I've got this magnificent Bannockburn free range chicken. I thought I'd give it some Portuguese treatment. I'll start by making a marinade using around 40 grams or so of softened butter. I've got some cumin seed and peppercorns in here. I'll just grind up. I've got some garlic cloves that I've finely chopped, but I'm just going to smash them up in the mortar and pestle. Along with some hot bird's eye chilies. Some dried oregano. Let's give it a crush. Juice of a lemon. Some smoked paprika. A couple of tablespoons. And my favourite ingredient, a couple of tablespoons scotch whiskey. And the final thing is just some roughly chopped coriander. into the bowl. And I'll leave that to one side just while I spatchcock my chicken. Now, to do this, the easiest way to start is to flip the chicken over and with some kitchen scissors I'm just going to cut either side of the backbone. I'll reserve that for stock. I'll just take the bird, just bend it back a little bit. What I'm going to do now is just take out the breastbone. I've run my knife either side of the bone. I'm just going to get my fingers in there to loosen it. You don't need to take all the bones out, you just take a few so it'll sit flat and cook evenly. Most of them you can pull out with your fingers. It's a little bit messy but it means that the chicken will cook nice and evenly. Roll the bird over. Tuck the wings under. Now I've got some gloves on because this marinade can really stain your hands. So I'll just give that a bit of a mash up. And now I just want to rub that all over the chicken. to 
get those flavours to infuse. And I'll put that into the fridge for an hour or two just to let that marinate. Now my chicken's been marinating for about two hours. I'm going to add about a teaspoon of salt. I've got an oven preheated to around 180 degrees Celsius and I'm just going to seal the chicken in this pan. I'll need a roasting tray just so it can go into the oven. So I've got that ready. My oil's nice and hot. And here I go into the pan, skin side down. Just add all those bits of butter. And I'll season on the other side. Now you could cook this on a barbecue and if you were lucky enough over coals would be even better. But I'm doing it in a pan today and all I'm trying to achieve here is just getting some colour, a nice golden skin before it goes into the oven. So it'll probably take one to two minutes. Now this smells incredible, all that smoked paprika, it's just beautiful. It's a little bit tricky to roll over, so you might need some tongs and a spatula. Just flip it over. Just melt that down. Pour it over the top and then into the oven for about 15 to 20 minutes. Now my chicken's ready, so I'll just take it out of the oven. There it is, look at that. I'll just carefully lift this out, pop it onto the board. And all I need to do is just chop it into pieces, serve it with some lemon. Now I'll just sprinkle over some pan juices. Some lemon wedges and some coriander. And there it is, my Portuguese chicken. <laughs> <laughs>